But first, it could happen to anyone. You slip out of the car to pump your gas, and thieves slide right in, stealing from you. They are not just stealing the valuables inside, in some cases, the entire car. That's right, new at 10 CBS News, Jermont Terry is live in Oak Forest, where gas stations are warning customers tonight. Jermont. Brad and Erica, this shell station of the 159th and Century is well lit, but that has not stopped these crooks. If you take a walk with me, it's been so many cases with thefts and people stealing cars that the gas stations, they have signs posted telling people to pay attention while you're pumping gas. While filling up at this gas and go in Tinley Park, Rosa McNeil admits she doesn't always pay attention. Are your doors locked right now? Let's show, show me. So you're pumping gas. And it turns out thieves are watching and targeting people in the southwest suburbs as they pump gas. If I'm like this, I'm oblivious. Such was the case last week at this Thornton's in Blue Island at 127th and Vincennes. Watch as a white SUV pulls up. Then someone sneaks out of the back door. The woman pumping gas doesn't see the man opening her passenger door, grabbing whatever is on the front seat. Even after slamming the car door and jumping back in the SUV, the woman pumping gas remains clueless. Oh, she didn't even hear the door close. And she's not alone. Police in Blue Island, Oak Forest, and Tinley Park all have reports of thieves sliding into unlocked cars, stealing phones, wallets, and purses. Is this a little creepy, or do you think no, people... No, that's very creepy. Signs are now posted at this Oak Forest shell station. Police reminding drivers to stay alert while filling up. But in Tinley Park, police say there's a good chance the men spotted in this video are behind three cars stolen recently. Customers at this station at 194th in Harlem left their cars running with the key fob inside. That's when the thieves pulled up. Someone jumped into the unlocked car, taking off. What will you do differently, Rosa? Lock my doors, for sure. Now, police say a white SUV is connected in all of these incidents. Now, they also point out that the license plate on that SUV is likely stolen. Interesting enough, and thankfully, there has been no weapons used and or applied, implied, I should say. However, police just telling people to stay alert out here. Reporting live in Oak Forest tonight, Jermont's area, CBS 2 News. Erica. All right, Jermont, thank you.